Yo, what's going on? My name is the Versuck My Nuts guy, and you're watching My Pain and Suffering. Now, you see this right here? This thing right here? Uh, this is the sacrifice tribute for Daddy Google so that I can get paid next to no money for my creativity. So, like, I don't know, maybe, like, watch the video in full or, like, 15 times in a row. That also works, and maybe, maybe I'll give you, like, a crisp high five. Do you keep doing dumb stuff like this where you're just driving along and then into an asteroid and you go Kirkablamo and then kaboom? Well, we're gonna fix that. Have you ever been traveling at Mach 69, about to hit an asteroid like so, and have no idea what to do? Well, then we have the product for you. Look, you just turn it on, and oh no, we're about to hit the asteroid. Oh no, what are we gonna do? And look, we instantly glide above it. Whoa! Buy now, on sale for 12 million easy payments of 69 cents. Now, just like the great prophet Uncle Carl, who was also a mechanic once said, if you don't know where something goes, bolt it into place. Maybe it will work. For this tutorial, we're only going to need four things. We're going to need device hardpoint, range finder, bolt and cable tool, and the brain power of an eight and a half year old. I recommend attaching your hard points somewhere on the left normally to the outside of your frame, somewhere on the right as well, and then in the center. After that, you just gotta throw your range finders onto the hard points like so. And now with a little bit of bad cable management, just like my PC, I decided to go and run my cables along the outside, just kind of like you can see as so. I kept it reasonably neat and then attached it into some other cables. Here is what I like to use for my range finders. So I like to set our on state as avoid on, and then the length that it's searching at is at a thousand, and it's a range finder distance. So this is what its actual distance happens to be. For this one, just because it is on the left, I'm gonna name, label this one AL for avoid left. For the middle, I did the exact same thing. Only difference is instead of AL, I used AM for avoid middle. And no reason to explain the right side. All I did was change AL to AR. My name is Ariana Grande, and this is my Roblox Lua programming tutorial. <laughs> All right, disclaimer. For some reason, when I bought my ship, the off state of cruise is equal to zero and its on state is equal to five. I don't know why or what it means, but I'm not going to change it. If you're curious or have questions, you should ask one of the 15 year olds in the comments. So personally, what I decided to do, I wanted to automate this into a single button push. Since I normally use avoidance systems while cruise control is on, you can change this. So if you want to make the button separate, that's totally cool. Uh, so this level of code, I would scale it uh, kind of in between beginner and intermediate. If you have questions, I do recommend also watching my entire playlist on Starbase tutorials because I go over some pretty crucial points there. All right, so line one checks if cruise control is turned on. And if it is, it will turn on every range finder and then go to line two. Lines two to four are watching for possible collisions. Remember how I explained on the range finder earlier that there's the actual value rather than what its set length is? So for example, uh, let's check if our right avoidance system is less than a thousand, meaning it is something has collided with the range finder laser and temporarily set the flight computer left and right to negative 100. This is going to result in pushing the ship to the left, while lines 3 and lines 4 do the exact same thing, which you should be able to figure out on your own. I hope you enjoy using this tutorial to avoid your X and Starbase, or asteroids I guess, you could do that too. Last thing you gotta do is install the YOLO chip, and then you're good to go. Enjoy avoiding shit! Five. I wake and bake and eat take out like every day I don't fuck with no small talk I don't care what you wanted to say I interrupt the conversation I ain't really got no patience Tell me what you want and I'll be on my motherfucking way